Start recording. Hi and welcome to Trojan. And on today's video, we're going to be crafting a 100% shock avoidant boots with asp is aspect of the spider, right? So aspect of the spider. So we're gonna spam essence of torment until we hit T1 or T2 spell suppression. Doesn't matter. With that empty suffix for 20% quality. Just cause it looks better. Okay, we got a shock avoided, but hmm, there yeah, we got T1 moving speed with T2 life for shock. Oh, how much is this boots worth? Two divides, dude. <laughs> Two divides. Fuck. <laughs> Alright, these boots could sell. <laughs> okay, I gotta go buy an expert. I got that boot. Cause one torment made me two divides. <laughs> Somewhat, it pays for the craft stuff, but I could probably finish the craft. I could probably craft after I got the spider on it or something and probably sell it for even much, much, much more. Be insane. Damn. Alright, back to crafting. Nope, go be looking. It's 1 in 35 for uh, T1 spell suppression. T2 might be a little less to hit the T2. We got T3, which nope. We're not going for T. Uh, we got movement speed again. Nope, nope. We're looking for the spell suppression. Okay, we got T1 spell suppression. We need to uh, annul the fire. Come on, annul the fire. Annul the fire. Nope, it Damn. took the spell suppression. Damn. That's usually what always happens. Okay, now we have to re. Okay, we got it back. But we need to annul the attributes. Uh, attributes. Yeah, reduce attributes requirements. And we took of course not. We took this the shock. The shock. <laughs> yeah, that's the hardest part is that annul the third. Well technically you can get it with an empty suffix, but it's gonna be a pain in the ass because you need so you usually will always mostly get four mods. So you have to get lucky on with the four mods with two on two on the prefix and two on the suffix. And then it's like a 1 in 10 to hit all 6 modifiers, which will be a pain. And okay, a lot of T1 chaos resistance. Okay, we got T1. Oh, we got it. That's perfect. Yep, it's got it. Now we just need to... We need to get the... Uh, we, like we're, going, we're going through level 30, right? So what, I need to get... What do I, um, what do I need to provide? Uh, I can buy them. Well, I have the Phenomous first, first of the night. Alright, so I'll just buy the Black Morgan. The Black Morgan. We did craft it um, on slot, right? The movement speed with the onslaught. Right, so now I just need the Phenoma Plague Arra. Yeah, the Phenoma Phenoma Sorry, Night. Made the beast. Nice. Put up the beast. Now we're going for it. Aspect of the Spider. Alright, level 30 Aspect of the Spider with. So we got pretty good goddamn life. Did we? Uh, this what 50. We this trash life. Done. Se you could craft on 70 life. Alright, so now we're going for. Which one is the one that gives us shock right now? One of the oh, one of them gives us shock. I think it, either. What does the the chance of avoid being shot back up? Well, if it's going to be wood, okay, it's zero point three per one. Nope, it's not worth to buy them in the mines. So we better just buy them with chaos. Oh, wait, all the chaos for one of these goddamn things. Damn. So we're gonna buy let's buy five. That's be two hundred chaos. Let's see if we get lucky in two hundred chaos. Let's see if we get lucky in two hundred chaos enough. How do you do that? Put them all over at once. Shift and CLRT. Shift and Cult. Shift and Control? Yep. Shift and Control, yeah. Shift and Control. Alright, so we go, We have 5. That's 200C of... Uh, spent more than 2 that's what? 240C. Which is very, very stupid. Yeah. So like, come on. They, they need to give us back field chaos swap. There is no deliberation about it. It's like, yes, we wanted Ashling to be... um. Let's call it um, not accessible only through TFT. But God, we didn't expect it to be this expensive because the made it, it, it um, kind of not, it doesn't drop like, if you do Caradine, it actually drops a veil chaos orb. No, it's, it's a chance of dropping it, which is a Ooh. pain in the ass. Like, no, and plus the, the um, betrayal is not really worth farming right now because the only, only reason you're farming doing betrayal is to get veil chaos orb and it's a chance to drop. Because nothing else from Calarina is worth it other than the Vilky or so. Yep, so we need good life with an empty, with an empty world to get good life. Alright, we got T2 evasion. We can block mana and slam it. Do I have, do I have an exalt? Yep, I want exalt. <laughs> want exalt. Block mana. Alright. Onslaught. Yeah, chance to get onslaught for 4 seconds on kill with the movement speed. 20%. Nope, we want at least around 20 with 10% chance. 20, 10%. 19 and 9 will work. Okay. That's close enough. Close enough. <laughs> close enough. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Uh, okay, now we need to roll the... Hope we hit the... Okay, we're looking for a chance to shock. 
chance avoid being stunned nope chance avoid being shot wait you're going chance avoid being shot so you get um is it to get 100 spell suppression with the jewel void elemental ailments with the jewel oh yeah yeah okay yeah that so we keep getting frozen we got action speed again nope nope okay so i need to go buy probably a devote of the lesser saying exact one do i buy right there at the top in okay 200 i don't think we need 200 i think we need 200 let's buy them for some chaos yeah 95 500 yeah 90 500 like 90 500 that's 80 90 100 right all right so we got 100 more to try and hit the chance of shock I got frozen again. Where is this? Is are you telling me shock is rarer than action speed? That's stupid. Or is this rare for me? <laughs> frozen again. Yep, I got frozen. I got chance. Wait, can I not hit shock with lessers? I wonder if that's the possibility. That could be the possibility, you know. Chance of avoid being ignited. Okay, chance of avoid being shock. So I'm apparently very unlucky. Apparently I'm very, very unlucky. <laughs> Look, we get it. There we got we it. Go. Got it. That's 35 plus the, the almost 60% from the thing that's 95%, 94%, no, around 93%. We can technically upgrade, we can upgrade it with um with the, the Orb of Conflict. Orb of Conflict would upgrade it, but to upgrade it with Orb of Conflict, I need to buy some grand here. So I need to buy some exceptional acre from the Eater, which is 40 chaos a pop. Probably just buy one or two, I think. Hopefully just one or two. If he doesn't kill the um let's buy more two. Like 50 chaos are pop for these things they loot. Then I need to buy some orb of conflicts. But if if it's not Yeah, we have a little bit, so let's see. Um so, um so we need to buy orb of conflict. You know, uh, looking to buy a pair of omens. Pair of omens. Oh for next god damn it's 70k. 70c per orb of conflict right now. Damn. Yeah, just just the over conflict part is gonna be expensive. If if I get unlucky, I think we just need to hit it once. Once to hit it to get it here, the upper. Actually, actually, we need to hit it two two times. I wonder if it's cost us cheaper to just roll it with um. What is this? What uh? We will have to roll it with not lessers but um grand grand Eldric ember grand. How much is grand? So we're going for. So we're slamming it with the exceptional acre chance of avoid being poisoned and hope we hit the upgrade the shock because we could get very unlucky but supposed to ah we got very unlucky what it took the, it took oh the shock goodness. which is so stupid frozen yep gotta keep rolling okay we go back the shock hit it again get okay, upgraded so we got the 38 percent so 38 plus 59 is we gotta hit it one more <laughs> one more so i need to go and buy I need to go and buy a, um, one more orb of conflicts, maybe, maybe. Let's hope so, it doesn't take the shock again. Well, now we will just downgrade it, upgrade it. Because sometimes you want, you want to go like the last tier above, uh, but there's two tier above exceptional. So, yeah. So we just had to hit it once more. So Let's see if I hit it or not. Okay, so I already applied the, the upper. Now, come on. Stupid bird is making noise. Alright, um, one more. Come on, upgrade the shock. And we got it. So now we have 100%. enough. Yep, that's 100% right there. Nice. Yes. So we know how much we spent. We spent 210 chaos stress on trying to upgrade it. Then how much for the Eldrix? <laughs> At least our two divines alone trying to. Yeah, both two divines just upgrading the um <laughs> the Eldrick into the sets. All right. Now we just roll the Eater of Wolves for what are we looking for? Cooldown recovery. Travel space. Yeah, cooldown. Yeah, straight cooldown reduction. Okay is enduring cry that's what i was so if you hit enduring cry again that's the one i need so it's enduring cry or cooldown recovery it says cooldown recovery on the boots uh yeah it says just five percent increased cooldown recovery rate but i'm using enduring cry so if you get cooldown recovery on enduring cry then i mean that's what i yeah. want <laughs> yeah. Yeah. see that's an intimidating cry travel skills again is a extra cold and five percent cooler recovery. Let's check the price of these boots now. Well, considering none of them are they they going to be everything with a minimum. They are on the market, what? They were on the market. Oh no, but these doesn't have like a MD suffix. Yeah, these doesn't have empty mm -hmm. suffix. That's one of T1 chaos resistance here, but we want the empty suffix. That's fine, so 
this one take off the take off that you're going for life with 20 percent movements there's only market for three divines but i don't think it has shot there's some zoning market for it is one of the first pressure with fires two gin three divines this one is so well there's not any market with aspect of the cat with spell suppression with chance of avoid being shot not only if i wanted to i could probably craft more of these boots and then sell them for we make a big <laughs> bang i will i don't know how much how much people are playing this build huh? so i don't even know how many people are playing this i would say these boots are probably worth like at least 15 to 20 divines before these boots are expensive okay yeah. and it cost me what five divines five divines oh. uh, probably around then yeah let's go about a divine and a half in it. but Eldrick. you're gonna get probably two divine back for the boots that you crafted with one of them yeah yeah and then yep yeah. you're wrong it's spent like a wrong yeah wrong five divines sir all right the craft is done guys and remember try to be less regenerate than i am